desert. Noun, usually in the plural, that which is deserved or merited, a just punishment or reward. Meant, verb, to intend. Crime, noun, a specific act committed in violation of the law. Verb, to subject to disciplinary punishment. Consideration, noun, the thought process of considering, of taking multiple or specified factors into account, with of being the main corresponding at position. Hesitate, verb, to stop or pause respecting decision or action, to be in suspense or uncertainty as to a determination. Inappropriate, adjective, not appropriate, not suitable for the situation, time, or place. Certainly. Adverb, in a way which is certain, with certainty. Chop. Noun. A cut of meat, often containing a section of a rib. Verb. To cut into pieces with short, vigorous cutting motions. Separation. Noun. The act of disuniting two or more things, or the condition of being separated. Honey. Noun. A viscous. Sweet fluid produced from plant nectar by bees. Often used to sweeten tea or to spread on baked goods. Verb. To sweeten. To make agreeable. Adjective. Involving or resembling honey. Placement. Noun. The act of placing or putting in place. The act of locating or positioning. The state of being placed. Aim. Noun. The pointing of a weapon. As a gun. A dart. Or an arrow or object, in the line of direction with the object intended to be struck. The line of fire, the direction of anything, such as a spear, a blow, a discourse, a remark, towards a particular point or object, with a view to strike or affect it. Verb, to point or direct a missile, or a weapon which propels as missile, towards an object or spot with the intent of hitting it. Lonely. Adjective, unhappy because of feeling isolated from contact with other people. Ambassador. Noun. A minister of the highest rank sent to a foreign court to represent there his sovereign or country. Sometimes called ambassador in residence. Arrange. Verb. To set up. To organize. To put into an orderly sequence or arrangement. Limited. Verb. To restrict. Not to allow to go beyond a certain bound. To set boundaries. Noun. An express train that only halts at a limited number of stops. Adjective. With certain. Often specified. Limits placed upon it. Reservation. Noun. The act of reserving, withholding or keeping back. Intended. Verb. Usually followed by the particle. To. To hope. To wish. Something or something to be accomplished. Be intent upon. Noun. Fiancé or fiancé. Adjective. Planned. Recovery. Noun. The act or process of regaining or repossession of something lost. Prescribe. Verb. To order. A drug or medical device. For use by a particular patient. Under licensed authority. Concrete. Noun. A solid mass formed by the coalescence of separate particles. A compound substance. A concretion. Verb. Usually transitive. To cover with or in case in concrete. Building material. Adjective. Real. Actual. Tangible. Nominate. Verb. To name someone as a candidate for a particular role or position. Including that of an office. Adjective. Nominotypical. Busy. Noun. A police officer. Verb. To make somebody busy or active. To occupy. Adjective. Crowded with business or activities. Having a great deal going on. Founded. Verb. To start. An institution or organization. Verb. To melt. Especially of metal in an industrial setting. Adjective. Having a basis. Courier. Noun. A person who looks after and guides tourists. Verb. To deliver by courier. Describes. Verb. To represent in words. Philosopher. Noun. A lover of wisdom. Firefighters. Noun. A person who puts out fires. Powers. Noun. 
ability to do or undergo something. Verb. To provide power for. A mechanical or electronic device. Requests. Noun. Act of requesting. With the adposition at in the presence of possessives. And on in their absence. Verb. To ask for. Something. Rehabilitation. Noun. The process of rehabilitating somebody or something. Accomplished. Verb. To finish successfully. Adjective. Completed. Effected. Established. Align. Verb. To form a line. To fall into line. Steep. Noun. The steep side of a mountain etc. A slope or acclivity. Adjective. Of a near vertical gradient. Of a slope. Surface. Curve. Etc. That proceeds upward at an angle near vertical. Contractor. Noun. A person or company that builds or improves buildings. Person. Noun. An individual. Usually a human being. Verb. To represent as a person. To personify. To impersonate. Sliced. Verb. To cut into slices. Adjective. That has been cut into slices. Hormone. Noun. Any substance produced by one tissue and conveyed by the bloodstream to another to affect. Physiological activity. Verb. To treat with hormones. Ahead. Adverb. In or to the front. In advance. Onward. Negative. Noun. Refusal or withholding of assents. Prohibition. Veto. Verb. To refuse. To veto. Adjective. Not positive nor neutral. Interjection. Signaling. An elaborate synonym for no. Feels. Adjective. Of or relating to the emotions. Noun. A quality of an object experienced by touch. Verb. Heading. To use or experience the sense of touch. Noun. Feelings. Emotions. Adjective. Noun. Grammar. A word that modifies a noun or describes a noun's referent. Verb. To make an adjective of. To form or convert into an adjective. Adjective. Incapable of independent function. Left. Noun. The left side or direction. Adjective. The opposite of right. Toward the west when one is facing north. Adverb. On the left side. Celebrating. Verb. To extol or honor in a solemn manner. Noun. Celebration. Catholic. Adjective. Of the Western Christian Church. As differentiated from e.g. the Orthodox Church. Adjective. Universal. All-encompassing. Mega. Adjective. Very large. Funnel. Noun. A utensil in the shape of an inverted hollow cone terminating in a narrow pipe. For channeling liquids or granular material. Typically used when transferring said substances from any container into ones with a significantly smaller opening. Verb. To use a funnel. Boiling. Verb. Of liquids. To heat to the point where it begins to turn into a gas. Noun. The process of changing the state of a substance from liquid to gas by heating it to its boiling. Point. Adjective. That boils or boil. Adverb. Of adjectives associated with heat. Extremely. Coded. Verb. To write software programs. Verb. Of a patient. To suffer a sudden medical emergency. A code blue. Such as cardiac arrest. Adjective. Encoded. Written in code or cipher. Photograph. Noun. A picture created by projecting an image onto a photosensitive surface such as a chemically treated plate or film, CCD receptor, etc. Verb. To take a photograph of. Concentrated. Verb. To bring to. Or direct toward. A common center. To unite more closely. To gather into one body. Mass. Or force. Adjective. Not dilute. Having a high concentration. Everyday. Noun. Rare. The ordinary or routine day or occasion. Adjective. Appropriate for ordinary use. Rather than for special occasions. Expect. Verb. To predict or believe that something will happen. Pray. Verb. To direct words and or thoughts to God or any higher being. 
for the sake of adoration, thanks, petition for help, etc. Adverb, please, used to make a polite request, realized, verb, to make real, to convert from the imaginary or fictitious into reality, to bring into real existence, looking, noun, the act of one who looks, a glance, contracts, noun, an agreement between two or more parties, to perform a specific job or work order, often temporary or of fixed duration and usually governed by a written agreement. Verb, to draw together or nearer, to shorten, narrow, or lessen, controller, noun, one who controls something, coming, verb, to move from further away to nearer to, liver, noun, a large organ in the body that stores and metabolizes nutrients, destroys toxins and produces bile. It is responsible for thousands of biochemical reactions. Adjective. Of the color of liver. Dark brown. Tinted with red and gray. Share. Noun. A portion of something. Especially a portion given or allotted to someone. Verb. To give part of what one has to somebody else to use or consume. Rewards. Noun. Something of value given in return for an act. Verb. To give a reward to or for. Archives. Noun. A place for storing earlier. An often historical. Material. An archive usually contains documents. Letters. Records. Newspapers. Etc. Or other types of media kept for historical interest. Verb. To put into an archive. Bread. Noun. A foodstuff made by baking dough made from cereals. Verb. To coat with breadcrumbs. French. Verb. To prepare food by cutting it into strips. Lobster. Noun. A crustacean of the nephropody family. Dark green or blue-black in color turning bright red when cooked. With a hard shell and claws. Which is used as a seafood. Verb. To fish for lobsters. Adjective. Red-colored. Especially from a sunburn. Misperception. Noun. An incorrect perception. Felt. Noun. A cloth or stuff made of matted fibers of wool. Or wool and fur. Fold or wrought into a compact substance by rolling in pressure. With lees or size. Without spinning or weaving. Verb. To make into felt. Or a felt-like substance. To cause to adhere and mat together. Armchair. Noun. A chair with supports for the arms or elbows. Verb. To create based on theory or general knowledge rather than data. Adjective. Remote from actual involvement. Including a person retired from previously active involvement. Easygoing. Adjective. Of a person. Calm, relaxed, casual and informal. Bargain. Noun. An agreement between parties concerning the sale of property. Or a contract by which one party binds himself to transfer the right to some property for a consideration. And the other party binds himself to receive the property and pay the consideration. Verb. To make a bargain. To make a deal or contract for the exchange of property or services. To negotiate. Caramel. Noun. A smooth. Chewy. Sticky confection made by heating sugar and other ingredients until the sugars polymerize and become sticky. Verb. To caramelize. Adjective. Of a yellow-brown color. Exit. Noun. An act of going out or going away. Or leaving. A departure. Verb. To go out or go away from a place or situation. To depart. To leave. Speaker. Noun. One who speaks. Minor. Noun. A person who is below the age of majority. Consent. Criminal responsibility or other adult responsibilities and accountabilities. Verb. To choose or have an area of secondary concentration as a student in a college or university. Adjective. Of little significance or importance. Everything. Pronoun. All the things under discussion. Sam. Noun. Surface to air missile. Safety. Noun. The condition or feeling of being safe. Security. Certainty. Verb. To secure. 
a mechanical component, as in aviation, to keep it from becoming detached even under vibration. Bowl. Noun. A roughly hemispherical container used to hold, mix or present food, such as salad, fruit or soup, or other items. Override. Noun. A mechanism, device or procedure used to counteract an automatic control. Verb. To ride across or beyond something. Shirt. Noun. An article of clothing that is worn on the upper part of the body. And often has sleeves. Either long or short. That cover the arms. Draft. Noun. A current of air. Usually coming into a room or vehicle. Verb. To write a first version. Make a preliminary sketch. Adjective. Referring to drinks on tap. In contrast to bottled. Cities. Noun. A large settlement. Bigger than a town. Sometimes with a specific legal definition. Depending on the place. Involved. Verb. To roll or fold up. To wind round. To entwine. Adjective. Complicated. Sketches. Noun. A rapidly executed freehand drawing that is not intended as a finished work. Often consisting of a multitude of overlapping lines. Verb. To make a brief. Basic drawing. Regards. Noun. A steady look, a gaze. Verb. To look at. To observe. Noun. Good wishes. Packaging. Verb. To pack or bundle something. Noun. The act of packing something. Armchair. Noun. A chair with supports for the arms or elbows. Verb. To create based on theory or general knowledge rather than data. Adjective. Remote from actual involvement. Including a person retired from previously active involvement. Regrets. Noun. Emotional pain on account of something done or experienced in the past. With a wish that it had been different. A looking back with dissatisfaction or with longing. Verb. To feel sorry about. A thing that has or has not happened. After think. To wish that a thing had not happened. That something else had happened instead. Rink. Noun. A man, especially a warrior or hero. Contact. Noun. The act of touching physically. Being in close association. Verb. To touch. To come into physical contact with. Merchant. Noun. A person who traffics in commodities for profit. Verb. As a resident of a region. To buy goods from a non-resident and sell them to another non-resident. Fan. Noun. A handheld device consisting of concertinated material. Or slats of material. Gathered together at one end. That may be opened out into the shape of a sector of a circle and waved back and forth in order to. Move air towards oneself and cool oneself. Verb. To blow air on. Something. By means of a fan. Handheld. Mechanical or electrical. Or otherwise. Debate. Noun. An argument. Or discussion. Usually in an ordered or formal setting. Often with more than two people. Generally ending with a vote or other decision. Verb. To participate in a debate. To dispute. Argue. Especially in a public arena. Registrar. Noun. An official keeper or recorder of records. Kilo. Noun. In the international system of units. The base unit of mass. Conceived of as the mass of one liter of water. But now defined by taking the fixed numerical value of the Planck constant h to be 6.626070015 times. 10 to 34 when expressed in units of kilogram. Operator m2. Operator s minus 1. Symbol. Kilogram. Questioning. Verb. To ask questions about. To interrogate. To inquire for information. Noun. The action of asking questions. A survey. An inquiry. Adjective. Characterized by questions. Inquisitiveness. Doubt or wonder. Sixth. Noun. Not used in the plural. The person or thing in the sixth position. Verb. To divide by six. Which also means multiplying a denominator by six. Adjective. The ordinal form of the number six. Boom. Noun. A low-pitched. 
resonant sound, such as of an explosion. Verb, to make a loud, hollow, resonant sound. Interjection, used to suggest the sound of an explosion. Elbow, noun, the joint between the upper arm and the forearm. Verb, to push with the elbow. Closest, verb, physical, to remove a gap. Adjective, closed, shut. Partners. Noun. Someone who is associated with another in a common activity or interest. Verb. To join as a partner. Parents. Noun. One of the two persons from whom one is immediately biologically descended. A mother or father. Verb. To act as parent. To raise or rear. Door. Noun. A portal of entry into a building. Room. Or vehicle. Consisting of a rigid plane movable on a hinge. Doors are frequently made of wood or metal. May have a handle to help open and close. A latch to hold the door closed and a lock that ensures the door cannot be opened without the key. Verb. To cause a collision by opening the door of a vehicle in front of an oncoming cyclist or pedestrian. Boss. Noun. A person who oversees and directs the work of others. A supervisor. Verb. To exercise authoritative control over. To tell. Someone. What to do. Often repeatedly. Adjective. Of excellent quality. First rate. Mineral. Noun. Any naturally occurring inorganic material that has a. More or less. Definite chemical composition and characteristic physical properties. Adjective. Of. Related to. Or containing minerals. Financing. Verb. To conduct. Or procure money for. Financial operations. Manage finances. Noun. A transaction that provides funds for a business. Avoid. Verb. To try not to meet or communicate with. A person. To shun. Crashing. Verb. To collide with something destructively. Fall or come down violently. Noun. The sound or action of something that crashes. Ants. Noun. Any of various insects in the family Formicidae in the order Hymenoptera. Typically living in large colonies composed almost entirely of flightless females. Verb. To rub insects. Especially ants. On one's body. Perhaps to control parasites or clean feathers. Clinic. Noun. A medical facility. Such as a hospital. Especially one for the treatment and diagnosis of outpatients. Injury. Noun. Damage to the body of a human or animal. Verb. To wrong. To injure. Jump. Noun. The act of jumping. A leap. A spring. A bound. Verb. To propel oneself rapidly upward. Downward and or in any horizontal direction such that momentum causes the body to become airborne. Adjective. Exact. Matched. Fitting. Precise. Adverb. Exactly. Precisely. Noun. An occasion when a performer or team of them, especially in vaudeville, expects to perform at a theater for a single evening. Meanings. Noun. Of words or symbols. The entity. Perception. Feeling or concept thereby represented or evoked. Picnics. Noun. An informal social gathering, usually in a natural outdoor setting, to which the participants bring their own food and drink. Verb. To take part in a picnic. Ability. Noun. Suitableness. Brother. Noun. Son of the same parents as another person. Verb. To treat as a brother. Interjection. Expressing exasperation. Confirmed. Verb. To strengthen. To make firm or resolute. Adjective. Having a settled habit. Inveterate or habitual. Deputy. Noun. One appointed as the substitute of another. And empowered to act for them. In their name or their behalf. A substitute in office. Verb. To deputize. Filtered. Verb. To sort, sift, or isolate. Adjective. With a filter. E.g., a cigarette. Checked. Verb. To inspect. To examine. Verb. To mark with a check pattern. Adjective. Having a pattern of checks. Checkered. Illegal. 
Noun. An illegal act or technique. Adjective. Contrary to or forbidden by law. Especially criminal law. Contract. Noun. An agreement between two or more parties. To perform a specific job or work order. Often temporary or of fixed duration and usually governed by a written agreement. Adjective. Contracted. Affianced. Betrothed. Congenital. Adjective. Of a trait or a disease. Present since birth. Shorts. Noun. A short circuit. Verb. To cause a short circuit in. Something. Noun. Trousers worn primarily in warm weather that do not go lower than the knees. Fresh. Noun. A rush of water. Along a river or onto the land. A flood. Verb. Commercial fishing. To pack. Fish. Loosely on ice. Adjective. Newly produced or obtained. Recent. Adverb. Recently. Just recently. Most recently. Neglect. Noun. The act of neglecting. Verb. To fail to care for or attend to something. Rooms. Noun. Opportunity or scope. To do something. Verb. To reside. Especially as a boarder or tenant. Handmade. Noun. An art or craft object made by hand. Adjective. Manufactured by hand. Accessories. Noun. Something that belongs to part of another main thing. Something additional and subordinate. An attachment. Containers. Noun. Someone who contains. Something that contains. Messes. Noun. A disagreeable mixture or confusion of things. Hence. A situation resulting from blundering or from misunderstanding. Disorder. Verb. Transitive. Often used with up. To make untidy or dirty. Noun. Mass. A church service. Verb. To take meals with a mess. Long. Noun. A long vowel. Verb. To take a long position in. Adjective. Having much distance from one terminating point on an object or an area to another terminating point. Usually applies to horizontal dimensions. See usage notes below. Authorization. Noun. Permission. Boarding. Verb. To step or climb onto or otherwise enter a ship. Aircraft. Train or other conveyance. Noun. The act of people getting aboard a ship aircraft. Train. Bus etc. Embarkation. Allergies. Noun. A disorder of the immune system causing adverse reactions to substances. Allergens. Not harmful to most and marked by the body's production of histamines and associated with atopy. Anaphylaxis. An asthma. Essay. Noun. Authorship. A written composition of moderate length. Exploring a particular issue or subject. Hiring. Verb. To obtain the services of in return for fixed payment. Noun. The act by which an employee is hired. Shows. Noun. A play. Dance. Or other entertainment. Verb. To display. To have somebody see. Something. Prevented. Verb. To stop. An outcome. To keep from. Doing something misplaced verb to put something somewhere and then forget its location to mislay adjective uncomfortable especially due to one's surroundings bowl noun a roughly hemispherical container used to hold mix or present food such as salad fruit or soup or other items masked verb to cover the face or something else in order to conceal the identity or protect against injury. To cover with a mask or visor. Verb. To mash. Verb. To bewilder. Confuse. Adjective. Wearing a mask or masks. Dance. Noun. A sequence of rhythmic steps or movements usually performed to music. For pleasure or as a form of social interaction. Verb. To move with rhythmic steps or movements especially in time to music. Produces. Verb. To yield, make or manufacture, to generate. Desire. Noun. Someone or something wished for. Verb. To want, to wish for earnestly. Daughter. Noun. One's female offspring. 
Senders. Noun. Someone who sends. Ants. Noun. Any of various insects in the family Formicidae in the order Hymenoptera. Typically living in large colonies composed almost entirely of flightless females. Verb. To rub insects. Especially ants. On one's body. Perhaps to control parasites or clean feathers. Leak. Noun. A crack. Crevice. Fissure. Or hole which admits water or other fluid. Or lets it escape. Verb. To allow fluid or gas to pass through an opening that should be sealed. Adjective. Leaky. Attend. Verb. To listen to. Something or someone. To pay attention to. Regard. Heed. Affliction. Noun. A state of pain, suffering, distress or agony. Pulled. Verb. To apply a force to. An object. So that it comes toward the person or thing applying the force. Adjective. Of cooked meat. Prepared by being torn into fine pieces. Nets. Noun. A mesh of string. Cord or rope. Verb. To catch by means of a net. Noun. The amount remaining after expenses are deducted. Profit. Verb. To receive as profit. Funny. Noun. A joke. Adjective. Amusing. Humorous. Comical. Adverb. In an unusual manner. Strangely. Chemical. Noun. Any specific chemical element or chemical compound or alloy. Adjective. Of or relating to chemistry. Greatly. Adverb. To a great extent or degree. Finished. Verb. To complete. Something. Adjective. Processed or perfected. Blockers. Noun. Agent noun of block. Something that blocks something else. Groundsman. Noun. A male groundskeeper. Innovation. Noun. The act of innovating. The introduction of something new, in customs, rights, etc. Shoemaker. Noun. A person who makes shoes. Pricing. Verb. To determine the monetary value of. An item. To put a price on. Noun. The act of setting a price. Diver. Noun. Someone who dives, especially as a sport. Problems. Noun. A difficulty that has to be resolved or dealt with. Additives. Noun. A substance added to another substance or product to produce specific properties in the combined. Substance. Insist. Verb. With on or upon or that plus ordinary verb form. To hold up a claim emphatically. Moisturizing. Verb. To make more moist. Partying. Verb. To celebrate at a party. To have fun. To enjoy oneself. Darned. Verb. Euphemism of dam. Verb. To repair by stitching with thread or yarn. Particularly by using a needle to construct a weave across a damaged area of fabric. Adjective. A minced oath for damned. Adverb. Degree. Damned. Extremely. Coupons. Noun. A section of a ticket. Showing the holder to be entitled to some specified accommodation or service. As to a passage over a designated line of travel. A particular seat in a theater. A discount. Etc. Mosque. Noun. A place of worship for Muslims, often having at least one minaret. A masjid. Chips. Noun. A small piece broken from a larger piece of solid material. Verb. To chop or cut into small pieces. Noun. A carpenter. Courgette. Noun. A particular variety of cucurbita pipo, a small marrow, squash. May. Verb. To be strong. To have power. Over. Armed. Verb. To take by the arm. To take up in one's arms. Verb. To supply with armor. Later especially. Weapons. Adjective. Sometimes in combination. Equipped. Especially with a weapon. Approximately. Adverb. Imprecise but close to in quantity or amount. Nauseous. Adjective. Causing nausea. Sickening or disgusting. Customs. Noun. In the plural. The duties or taxes imposed on imported or exported goods. Guidelines. 
Noun, a nonspecific rule or principle that provides direction to action or behavior. Pressure. Noun, a pressing, a force applied to a surface. Verb, to encourage or heavily exert force or influence. Rock. Noun, a formation of minerals, specifically. Gatekeeper. Noun, a person or group who controls access to something or somebody. Rain. Noun, condensed water falling from a cloud. Verb, to have rain fall from the sky. Analyst. Noun, someone who analyzes. Drummer. Noun, one who plays the drums. Media. Noun, the middle layer of the wall of a blood vessel or lymph vessel which is composed of connective and muscular tissue. Reorganize. Verb, to organize something again, or in a different manner. Playground. Noun. Outdoors. A large open space for children to play on. Usually having dedicated play equipment. Such as swings and slides. Roads. Noun. A way used for traveling between places. Originally one wide enough to allow foot passengers and horses to travel. Now. U.S. Usually one surfaced with asphalt or concrete and designed to accommodate many vehicles traveling in both directions. In the UK both senses are heard. A country road is the same as a country lane. Noun. Occasionally in the singular. A roadstead. O. Noun. The name of the Latin script letter O. E. Noun. The name of the Latin script letter E. Conversation. Noun. Expression and exchange of individual ideas through talking with other people. Also, a set instance or occasion of such talking. Verb. To engage in conversation. With. Graduating. Verb. To be recognized by a school or university as having completed the requirements of a degree studied. At the institution. Guest. Verb. To reach a partly, or totally, unqualified conclusion. Instructions. Noun. The act of instructing, teaching, or furnishing with information or knowledge. Damages. Verb. To impair the soundness, goodness, or value of. To harm or cause destruction. Noun. The money paid or awarded to a claimant. In England. A pursuer. In Scotland. Or a plaintiff. In the U.S. In a civil action as compensation for a loss suffered by the same. Cucumbers. Noun. A vine in the gourd family. Cucumis sativus. Easier. Adjective. Comfortable. At ease. Adverb. In a relaxed or casual manner. Progressing. Verb. To move, go, or proceed forward. To advance. Invalid. Adjective. Not valid. Not true, correct, acceptable or appropriate. Emotional. Adjective, of or relating to the emotions. Leaf. Noun. The usually green and flat organ that represents the most prominent feature of most vegetative. Plants. Verb. To produce leaves. Put forth foliage. Shows. Noun. A play. Dance. Or other entertainment. Verb. To display. To have somebody see. Something. Fault. Noun. A defect. Something that detracts from perfection. Verb. To criticize. Blame or find fault with something or someone. Page. Noun. One of the many pieces of paper bound together within a book or similar document. Verb. To mark or number the pages of. As a book or manuscript. Bench. Noun. A long seat with or without a back. Found for example in parks and schools. Verb. To remove a player from play. Restrict. Verb. To restrain within boundaries. To limit. To confine. Adjective. Restricted. Championship. Noun. A competition to determine a champion, especially the final of a series of competitions. Neck. Noun. The part of the body connecting the head and the trunk found in humans and some animals. Verb. To hang by the neck. Strangle. Kill. Eliminate. Assets. Noun. Something or someone of any value. 
Any portion of one's property or effects so considered. Noun. Any property or object of value that one possesses. Usually considered as applicable to the payment of one's debts. Bumpy. Adjective. Rough. Jumpy. Causing or characterized by jolts and irregular movements. Part. Noun. A portion. A component. Verb. To leave the company of. Adjective. Fractional. Partial. Adverb. Partly. Partially. Fractionally. Serving. Verb. Personal. To provide a service. Or. By extension. A product. Especially food or drink. Noun. The action of the verb to serve. Adjective. That or who serves or serve. Oppression. Noun. The exercise of authority or power in a burdensome, cruel, or unjust manner. Disapprove. Verb. To condemn. To consider wrong or inappropriate. Used with of. Something. Noun. An object whose nature is yet to be defined. Verb. Applied to an action whose name is forgotten by. Unknown or unimportant to the user. E.g. from words of a song. Adjective. Having a characteristic that the speaker cannot specify. Adverb. Degree. Somewhat. To a degree. Pronoun. An uncertain or unspecified thing. One thing. Install. Noun. Installer. A software utility that installs an application. Verb. To connect. Set up or prepare something for use. In case. Verb. To enclose, as in a case. Prosecution. Noun. The act of prosecuting a scheme or endeavor. Rocket. Noun. A rocket engine. Verb. To accelerate swiftly and powerfully. Minor. Noun. A person who is below the age of majority. Consent. Criminal responsibility or other adult responsibilities and accountabilities. Verb. To choose or have an area of secondary concentration as a student in a college or university. Adjective. Of little significance or importance. Phrase. Noun. A short written or spoken expression. Verb. To express. An action. Thought or idea. By means of particular words. Action. Noun. Something done so as to accomplish a purpose. Verb. To act on a request etc. In order to put it into effect. Interjection. Demanding or signifying the start of something. Usually an act or scene of a theatric performance. Putting. Verb. To place something somewhere. Noun. Instigation or incitement. Enticement. Calendars. Noun. Any system by which time is divided into days. Weeks. Months. And years. Verb. To set a date for a proceeding in court. Usually done by a judge at a calendar call. Lengthened. Verb. To make longer, to extend the length of. Cow. Noun. Properly, an adult female of the species Bos Taurus, especially one that has calved. I. Noun. An organ through which animals see. Perceive surroundings via light. Verb. To observe carefully or appraising ly. Pop. Noun. A loud. Sharp sound as of a cork coming out of a bottle. Verb. To make a pop. Or sharp. Quick sound. Interjection. Used to represent a loud. Sharp sound. As of a cork coming out of a bottle. Poem. Noun. A literary piece written in verse. Recession. Noun. The act or an instance of receding or withdrawing. Greedy. Adjective. Having greed. Consumed by selfish desires. Convinced. Verb. To make someone believe. Or feel sure about something. Especially by using logic. Argument or evidence. Adjective. In a state of believing. Especially from evidence but not necessarily. Cleaner. Noun. A person whose occupation is to clean floors, windows and other things. Fraud. Noun. The crime of stealing or otherwise illegally obtaining money by use of deception tactics. Verb. To defraud. Border. Noun. The outer edge of something. Verb. To put a border on something. Church. Noun. A Christian house of worship. 
a building where Christian religious services take place. Verb. To conduct a religious service for a woman after childbirth or a newly married couple. Likely. Noun. Something or somebody considered likely. Adjective. Probable. Having a greater than even chance of occurring. Laser. Noun. A device that produces a monochromatic. Coherent beam of light. Verb. To cut with a laser. Eat. Noun. Something to be eaten. A meal. A food item. Verb. To ingest. To be ingested. Memorize. Verb. To learn by heart. Commit to memory. Informed. Verb. To instruct. Train. Usually in matters of knowledge. Adjective. Instructed. Having knowledge of a fact or area of education. Fist. Noun. A hand with the fingers clenched or curled inward. Verb. To strike with the fist. Raspberry. Noun. The plant Rubus edius. Verb. To gather or forage for raspberries. Adjective. Containing or having the flavor, flavor of raspberries. Jailer. Noun. One who enforces confinement in a jail or prison. Codes. Noun. A short symbol. Often with little relation to the item it represents. Verb. To write software programs. Verb. Of a patient. To suffer a sudden medical emergency. A code blue. Such as cardiac arrest. Draw. Noun. The result of a contest that neither side has won. A tie. Verb. To move or develop something. Beware. Verb. Defective. To use caution. Pay attention to. Used both with and without of. Amazing. Verb. To fill with wonder and surprise. To astonish. Astound. Surprise or perplex. Adjective. Causing wonder and amazement. Very surprising. Cards. Noun. A playing card. Verb. To check IDs. Especially against a minimum age requirement. Noun. Material with embedded short wire bristles. Verb. Glazier. Noun. One who glazes. A craftsman who works with glass, fitting windows, etc. Acceptance. Noun. The act of accepting. A receiving of something offered. With acquiescence. Approbation. Or satisfaction. Especially. Favorable reception. Approval. Noun. A conserved property of the light in an optical system which characterizes how, spread out, the light is in terms of angle and area. It is the product of its cross-sectional area, normal to the direction of propagation, and the solid angle it subtends. Euros. Noun. Person living or originating from Europe. Noun. The currency unit of the European Monetary Union. Symbol. Euro. Noun. Macropus robustus. A wallaroo. Macropod species. Riddle. Noun. A verbal puzzle. Mystery. Or other problem of an intellectual nature. Verb. To speak ambiguously or enigmatically. Savings. Noun. A reduction in cost or expenditure. Allergy. Noun. A disorder of the immune system causing adverse reactions to substances. Allergens. Not harmful to most and marked by the body's production of histamines and associated with atopy. Anaphylaxis. An asthma. Calibration. Noun. The act of calibrating something. Looks. Noun. One's appearance or attractiveness. Sending. Verb. To make something. Such as an object or message. Go from one place to another. Noun. The act by which somebody or something is sent. Causing. Verb. To set off an event or action. Cage. Noun. An enclosure made of bars. Normally to hold animals. Verb. To confine in a cage. To put into and keep in a cage. Blind. Noun. A covering for a window to keep out light. The covering may be made of cloth or of narrow slats that can block light or allow it to pass. Verb. To make temporarily or permanently blind. Adjective. Of a person or animal. Unable to see. Due to physiological or neurological factors. Adverb. Without seeing. 
unseeingly. Pear. Noun. An edible fruit produced by the pear tree. Similar to an apple but elongated towards the stem. Clearance. Noun. The act of clearing or something, such as a space, cleared. Effect. Noun. The result or outcome of a cause. Verb. To make or bring about. To implement. Shopping. Verb. To visit stores or shops to browse or explore merchandise. Especially with the intention of buying such merchandise. Noun. The process of buying goods or services. Or searching for those suitable to buy. Reject. Noun. Something that is rejected. Verb. To refuse to accept. Lung. Noun. A biological organ of vertebrates that controls breathing and oxygenates the blood. Penthouse. Noun. An outhouse or other structure. Especially one with a sloping roof. Attached to the outside wall of a building. Sometimes as protection from the weather. Verb. To provide with a penthouse. Shelter by means of a shed sloping from a wall. Or anything similar. Browsing. Verb. To scan. To casually look through in order to find items of interest. Especially without knowledge of what to look for beforehand. Noun. A place abounding with shrubs where animals may browse. Lung. Noun. A biological organ of vertebrates that controls breathing and oxygenates the blood. Paint. Noun. A substance that is applied as a liquid or paste. And dries into a solid coating that protects or adds color, color to an object or surface to which it has been applied. Verb. To apply paint to. 11. Noun. A cricket team of 11 players. Hence first 11. The team of best cricket players. At a school. Second 11. The. B. Team. Etc. Numeral. The cardinal number occurring after 10 and before 12. Represented as 11 in Arabic digits. Southeast. Noun. The direction of the cardinal compass point halfway between south and east. Specifically 135 degrees. Abbreviated as SE. Adjective. Southeastern. Southeasternmost. Occupying a position that is relatively southeast of another. Document. Noun. An original or official paper used as the basis. Proof. Or support of anything else. Including any writing. Book. Or other instrument conveying information pertinent to such proof or support. Verb. To record in documents. Precision. Noun. The state of being precise or exact. Exactness. Adjective. Used for exact or precise measurement. Greatly. Adverb. To a great extent or degree. Couple. Noun. Two partners in a romantic or sexual relationship. Verb. To join. Two things. Together. Or. One thing. Two. Another. Adjective. Two or. A. Small number of. Kindergarten. Noun. An educational institution for young children. Usually between ages 4 and 6. Nursery school. Accelerate. Verb. To cause to move faster. To quicken the motion of. To add to the speed of. Adjective. Accelerated. Quickened. Hastened. Hurried. Sparkling. Verb. To emit sparks. To throw off ignited or incandescent particles. Noun. Act or appearance of something that sparkles. A sparkle. A gleam. Adjective. Of an object. Reflecting light as if giving off tiny sparks. Sheet. Noun. A thin bedcloth used as a covering for a mattress or as a layer over the sleeper. Verb. To cover or wrap with cloth. Or paper. Or other similar material. Attic. Noun. The space. Often unfinished and with sloped walls. Directly below the roof in the uppermost part of a house or other building. Generally used for storage or habitation. Bed. Noun. A piece of furniture. Usually flat and soft. On which to rest or sleep. Verb. Senses relating to a bed as a place for resting or sleeping. Leaving. Verb. To have a consequence or remnant. Verb. To give leave to. Allow. Permit. Let. Grant. Verb. 
to produce leaves or foliage. Verb. To raise. To levy. If. Noun. An uncertainty. Possibility. Condition. Doubt etc. Conjunction. Supposing that. Assuming that. In the circumstances that. Used to introduce a condition or choice. Armchair. Noun. A chair with supports for the arms or elbows. Verb. To create based on theory or general knowledge rather than data. Adjective. Remote from actual involvement. Including a person retired from previously active involvement. Ruined. Verb. To cause the fiscal ruin of. Adjective. Incapacitated by drugs or alcohol. Graduate. Noun. A person who is recognized by a university as having completed the requirements of a degree studied at the institution. Verb. To be recognized by a school or university as having completed the requirements of a degree studied at the institution. Adjective. Graduated. Arranged by degrees. Enroll. Verb. To enter. A name, etc., in a register, roll or list. Flowing. Verb. To move as a fluid from one position to another. Noun. The action of the verb to flow. Adjective. Tending to flow. Extended. Verb. To increase in extent. Adjective. Longer in length or extension. Elongated. Handlers. Noun. One who handles something, especially manually, or someone. Spends. Noun, amount of money spent, during a period, expenditure. Verb, to pay out, money. Controversial. Adjective, arousing controversy, a debate or discussion of opposing opinions. Overbooked. Verb, to sell or guarantee more seats for an event, than actually exist. Adjective, having had more seats or tickets sold or guaranteed than were available. Lexicographer. Noun. One who writes or compiles a dictionary. Participant. Noun. One who participates. Adjective. Sharing. Participating. Having a share of part. Luggage. Noun. The bags and other containers that hold a traveler's belongings.